What is going on boys and girls of YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we're gonna be going over the deck that I've been using for the Attribute 4 event in Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. Uh, I've been using the uh, Phantasmal Spiral Dragons. Uh, it's been pretty successful so far. Um, I've actually gotten up to, I think, 5,500 trophies in the event. Um, so pretty much just a beatdown deck. Um, your main goal in this deck is just to try to get pacifists on the field. And this card says you cannot normal or special summon effect monsters the turn you activate either of this card's effects. Uh, once per turn, if you normal or special summon exactly one normal monster and no other cards, you can add one past Tasm Spiral card from your deck to your hand. If your opponent activates a card or effect, uh, you can put a token on the field that has 2,000 attack, 2,000 defense. Uh, there's multiple ways that you can get this card out on the field. Um, Fish Sonar is one to get your Megalo Smasher card. Uh, the big one to get this card out on the field is to use your uh, C Stealth Attack. This card reads, when this card is activated, you can activate one Umi from your hand or graveyard while Umi is on the field. This face-up card gains these effects. Uh, once per turn, you can banish one water monster you control until the end phase. This turn, face-up spells and traps you control cannot be destroyed by your opponent's card effects, even if this card leaves the field. At the start of the damage step, if your water monster whose original level is 5 or higher battles an opponent's monster, you destroy that opponent's monster. People don't read in Yu-Gi-Oh. You'll see later on in the gameplay that I activate this card and someone attacks my 2000 monster with the 2700 monster beat stick and his monster just explodes. Uh, they don't read. So uh, I'm running Abyss Dweller in here just in case anything for graveyard effects to try to stop uh, Panker Tops, because that is a very viable deck in this uh, event. I'm also running Zodiacs as my the, in my extra deck, Baguska, and then I just have Nightmare Cerberus and Nightmare Phoenix. Uh, in today's gameplay, we've got a gameplay against a Yosinju deck. Um, I will show the Yosinju deck at the end of the video. But this is the deck that I've been playing. And without further ado, uh, thank you. Please, if you enjoy this kind of content, let me know by leaving a comment down below. Let me know what deck you guys are running in your event. Uh, also, smash the like button while you're down there. It really helps out the YouTube channel, picks up the algorithm, and sends the channel flying. So, appreciate you guys, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace.